many times I'm, I'm kind of going back to your uh, background as a magician because I find that just so interesting. You know, so many times as a magician, what we're doing on stage, you know, I was a, a magician's assistant. What the, the goal of the, the performance is to misdirect attention. But I find with, um, with organizational change management, sometimes there's organizations who think they can, you know, say, look over here, and then they'll change something almost <laughs> like a magician. They try to divert attention. But I find, I, I don't know. I think people need to be more focused on the change. What do you think? Oh, absolutely. I mean, again, how are they going to carry it through and implement it if, if they're not familiar with it and know the details of it and know what results it's going to be bring uh, to the customer? How can they sell this, for lack of a better word, to uh, their subordinates, to the customer, to the public, to their community that they might be in? Let's face it, some changes do affect the community. So uh, if they're going to build something in a community that might affect the community, either take away or add jobs or uh, technology, like you say, uh, who is going to be uh, able to implement that change by having the knowledge to use that technology? And if they don't, how are you going to get it to them? How are you going to get it to them? Yeah, that's the that's part of the the big mystery, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> that's right. And, and it, it doesn't work by magic. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Unfortunately, I wish it did.